Did you know that the Center for Disease Control recently estimated that each year there are approximately 48 million cases of foodborne illnesses, including 128,000 hospitalizations, and even worse, 3,000 deaths. Working in the food industry comes with great responsibility. Foodborne illnesses cost the U.S. economy more than $77 billion each year. Hi, I'm Clint Stevenson, and I'm the instructor for FS350. My background is a little different than most professors in our program. Before teaching at NC State, I worked in quality assurance for several food companies, including Nestle, Kraft, General Mills, Heinz, and Schreiber Foods, working with meat, dairy, and prepared food products. I chose to teach food safety and quality classes since I noticed the big need for professionals properly trained in food safety and quality while working in industry, and I enjoy teaching. This course prepares you to work in the food industry with confidence that your food products will be safe and wholesome and not cause any foodborne illnesses. The HACCP food safety system is required for processors of certain food products and it is about to become more heavily regulated due to President Obama's signing of the Food Safety Modernization Act. This course begins with an introduction and history of hazard analysis and critical control points. You will learn how HACCP controls foodborne hazards by either prerequisite programs or critical control points. The bulk of the course is then spent learning about the seven principles of HACCP for managing critical control points. You will also learn about federal agency enforcement policies and federal regulations concerning the application of HACCP. This course is unique within the food science curriculum because it is also part of a certification program in which you may earn a HACCP coordinator certificate that is approved by the International HACCP Alliance. You can earn this certificate if you also take FS351, Good Manufacturing Practices, and FS353, Sanitation Standard Operating Procedures. I believe you will enjoy and value the learning experiences that this course will provide you, and I look forward to seeing you in the online classroom.